Oh, hey there. So I keep getting asked. <clears throat> this is a, a yurt, or here they call them a gur, uh, what the inside looks like. So let me just show you. So this is the outside. You can tell that they, uh, they have, they're almost like kits or something like that. <clears throat> so they can take them down and put them up somewhere else. These are on concrete because it's kind of, kind of like a campground. Um, they come in all shapes and sizes. Most of them are exactly this shape and exactly this size, but there are smaller ones too, and there are bigger ones. So this is what the inside is. You can tell there's a bed. This one has like a double king or California king, whatever you call that. And there's another bed right there. This one has electricity. Um, there's a light switch there. And then we've got our <clears throat> cell phones and stuff. Um, it's got this little, little sink kind of a thing. I haven't used it. Um, and some of them have different things. Like uh, I've seen them with fridges, small fridges. And usually, the, oh, there's like a little stove right here um, that goes up out through the top. And so... That's what they look like on the inside. Now, they asked, is it good sleeping? <clears throat> You're asking the wrong person. I don't sleep good anywhere. Uh, they're pretty hard. I bought some matte things, and they are ineffective. So I don't sleep well, but, you know, I'm sure that they could be decent. Now, these, um, the outside of this can be lifted up, and there's kind of a, a wood lattice work type of a thing. <clears throat> and so if you're too hot then, you know, you lift it up and air blows through. And if you're too cold, then I guess make a better fire. So that's, that's what they look like. This, this one is painted, um, around all this stuff. Uh, it looks like it's hand painted. Some of them, a lot of them are not. So that's, that's what this yurt looks like on the inside. And we've been in this one. This is our third day in this one. <clears throat> and, um, and the people here are beautiful and the landscape is gorgeous. So thank you.